Given the last year, it's hard not to feel overwhelmed by the uncertainty and challenges that have come from learning in a pandemic. As we approach a return to school in September, you might be wondering how to foster a successful transition for your child to special needs in a positive and optimistic way. Here are a few suggestions. Focus on growth as opposed to perceived learning losses. Over the last year, we have shown resilience and adaptability, and we need to give our students credit for the amazing things they were able to accomplish and overcome. Many students have developed the ability to learn new routines, technology skills, and other important life skills to help foster their independence. Secondly, support and reassure your child by acknowledging, monitoring, and working through their feelings together. Remember, it's normal to feel anxious. Pay attention to behavioral changes, especially for our students who might have difficulties expressing themselves. Implement alternatives for reacting to stressful situations like mindfulness and breathing exercises. It's a team effort. Developing a positive and strong support network through family, social, and other outlets can put us in a better position to handle stress and makes it easier to maintain an optimistic mindset in the coming year. Carving out quality time through activities such as drawing, reading, and family games is the best thing we can do to facilitate positive development of social and emotional connections. Your child's teacher and others at the school or within the school board are also part of your team.